All right, g'day guys. Welcome to another beer review with the Mad Adder. Today we've got uh, day 10 of the Page Bottlers Beer Vent Cube. Um, it's, a, it's a brewery I've, I've not heard of them per se, but uh, I have heard of their, uh, their big brother parent brewery, which is uh, Hargraves Hill. Um, today we've got a beer from, um, they're called Beatnik. And basically they're like a pseudonym for Hargraves Hill and it allows them to get adventurous and wild and maybe try things um, outside the mainstream. And I really appreciate the fact that instead of just having a bunch of beers from the same Hargraves Hill Brewery logo, they've just they've actually made it separate, which means they can be a bit more, as they say, a bit more fearless. Um, and just really just play with it. So, yeah, uh, about the brewery. Beatnik is Hargraves Hill, Hargraves Hill's rebellious little brother who's more concerned with the bigger questions in life and exploring his inner and outer worlds than to be conforming to the notions of what society expects him to do, which is what most breweries are doing, right? They're knocking out beer after beer after beer. That's just, just I just want beer that tastes like real beer. Um, with an adventurous spirit, Beatnik explores the spaces that only cans can go. Beatnik is big, bold and fearless, embracing the open road before us and the world of possibilities. Fate loves the fearless and the fearless loves Beatnik. That's a cute little poem. Anyway, let's get this beer out. Number 10. And... Today, we have, from Beatnik, their Raspberry Sour, which I'm very much looking forward to. Um, comes in at 4% ABV, and uh, really nice, simple can, just like they've got pretty flat logoing uh, across their whole range of beers. The colors change a bit, and that's that's kind of about it, but it's, uh, it's all very uniform. I, I really dig it. Um, the only thing it does say on the can is, a refreshing sour beer jam-packed with raspberries. Perfect for hanging in the park or sipping by the pool. Well, fortunately for me, I'm going to be drinking it in my kitchen on a rainy day here in Canberra. So that's that. Let's give it a crack. Not bad. Mmm. Oh. So... One thing with sours that I've noticed is sometimes they're either kind of like just taste like a bad beer or they don't taste anything like beer. Um, this already smells like it's got both. What you, it's a sour beer, so it's sour raspberries. But you can still smell that beer. Mm. Interesting. Really light in flavour, really light in mouthfeel as well. Kind of very carbonated, but not fizzy. Does that make? Doesn't make sense. Anyway, let's give it a pour. Pours like pink lemonade. Actually looks like a uh, lemon lime bitters from the RSL. Yeah, this looks like a raspberry lemonade. Does not taste like one though. Beat me. So in the in the glass, it's again it's it's doing it a favour. You you get more air in there, you, the aroma changes. It's now it's much more raspberry laden. That it's out of the can. It, it smells interesting. Out of the glass, it smells good. That's not a bad sour. I reckon some people I know want no part of fruity beers, <coughs> sours, and the like. But I reckon they could get away with drinking this because the raspberry is subtle enough 
to not take away from the beery aspects of the beer. Um, but it's still there and it's, it's quite nice. Um, definitely not the best sour I've had. Uh, I wouldn't buy it. Um, there's, there's too many good sours out there. So I think uh, you can get, you know, the Sunny Boys and, and there's a bunch of different, like Hope Brewery do a bunch of really good sours and there's just other sours out there that you choose first, I think. But it's not bad. Uh, I'm gonna give it a 3.5 because it's decent. Um, it's decent and it's uh, worth a shot if it comes in a beer bank queue. So, yeah. Good job, guys. Interested to try their other beers as well. Look like they do have some, some pretty uh, neat little experiments going on down there at Beatnik. So, yeah, I'll look out for them. All right, cheers, guys.